air pollution have been linked with the air quality. High level of air pollution according to the EPA, air quality, directly can show the quality of the air. Air pollution consists of chemical or particle at the atmosphere. Some of air pollution comes from natural sources such as volcanic eruption and forest fires. But most of the air pollution results from human activities such as energy use in agriculture, transportation, and industry and power plant. But then, how come the volcanic eruption happen and how this natural phenomenon related to the air quality? Deep within Earth, it is so hot that some rocks slowly melt and become a thick, flowing substance called magma. Since it is lighter than solid rock around it, magma rises and collects in magma chambers. Eventually, some of the magma push through vent and fissure to the Earth's surface. Magma that erupted is called lava. Volcanic gases that pose the greatest potential hazard are sulfur dioxide, carbon dioxide, and hydrogen fluoride. Locally, sulfur dioxide gas can lead to the acid rain and air pollution downwind from a volcano. Here, I will show a replica of a process of a volcanic eruption. Okay, then uh, this washing soap. After that, so that we can Okay, then put some coloring. Finally, vinegar, vinegar. Okay, done. But then, how can the volcanic related to the quality of the air? Um, volcanic eruption emit toxic gases that causes air pollution like I said before. Volcanic gases that pose the greatest potential hazard are sulfur dioxide, carbon dioxide and hydrogen fluoride. Locally sulfur dioxide gas can lead to the acid rain and air pollution downwind from a volcano. A temperature and solar radiation affect the quantities of pollution emitted by their influence on the amount of space heating required. Sunshine is required in a photochemical production of oxidants forming smoke. The wind velocity and stability affect the transport. Finally, the humidity is a frequent and important factor in determining the effect that concentration of pollution have and property vegetation and health. This volcanic eruption can change the air quality and weather in a long term on a climate making the world cooler. From the volcano also, fast moving lava can kill people and falling ash can make it hard for them to breathe. 
They can also die from famine, fires and earthquakes which can be related to the volcanoes. People also can lose their possession as volcanoes can destroy houses, roads and fields. To conclude, a volcanic activity is an example of a natural resources of a global air pollution. In addition to magma particulates known as ash, volcanic eruption release large of quantity greenhouse gases into the atmosphere which can affect to the entire globe. Volcanic eruption also, also can affect to the people and the environment. Earth biosphere can dis can depreciate as a result of volcanic pollution. Finally, the emission of toxic gases and ash contribute to polluted air and may affect human health.